Thanks, Chi Chi. I hope everyone had a very happy new year. Um, my husband and I spent it at home in bed <laughs> when he got off. And um, at New Year's, I called my parents, which um, I'm usually with them on New Year's, but it was super cold here and it was raining and I just didn't want to be out. So, and my husband was getting off early and so I just wanted to be with him. So I have a bit of a haul today. Um, it's a little bit of this and a little bit of that. And um, I don't have a card share yet. I made my husband's Valentine's Day card the other day. And then I made another Valentine's Day card. I I've just been coloring, guys. Um, I'm trying to get better at coloring. So I've been watching little tutorials. Not little, some of them have been long. But I can show y'all what I've been coloring. So I'll go ahead and show those. So I did these little guys and I put glossy accents on the lights. Um, and then I did some CC designs. I did this girl. So I've been doing a lot of Copic coloring. Um, just trying to get better at it. And um, I did a La La Land girl and these gnomes. Let me share that with you. Here she is, little Marcy. And then here are the gnomes that go with her. The three gnomes. And then I did some more CC designs. Isn't she cute? I think she is so adorable. And then I did a Kiki, it's also a CC Designs. And I paper pieced part of her right here, the little apron. And then I did my first brown skin girl. And I think she came out really good. I'm gonna um, make a card for my sister-in-law um, with her. What do y'all think? I'd love feedback. And this one I did the other night. I think they're so cute. So that's all I've been doing, lots of coloring. All right, let me get into the haul. Um, I got this from the Stamps of Life and it took a month to get here. I don't, I don't know what's going on. And they sent me a little extra freebie, these. I guess because it took so long, I don't know. But I got these dies, and I just need to get the stamp. They go with the love bugs that I got with the kit of the month, which was also the dies, because uh, I'm also a stamp and die member, die hard member. But this was the extra, this one's called the more love bugs to stamp. So it's the additional stamp set, stamp and die set she did. So cute. So I got that. I placed an order with CC Designs because she was having a retirement sale and I got such a good deal. I think I might have paid $3 for this die and I got these for the gnomes. Little mushroom border with grass, is there grass? Yeah, there's a little bit of grass and mushrooms. I thought that was a really good deal. And then there's this treat bag that I got for less than $5 and then it comes with the tags also. And these little enamel dots were $1.50. And this Valentine's Day paper pad was $1.50. So it was a steal. So I got those. And then I placed in two orders on Amazon. Y'all know I love Maggie Holmes and my favorite, um, paper pad from her is carousel well I didn't have this and I kind of paid more I know I did than what I should have but I really wanted it because I don't have this one it's this pack right here and this is what's in it so I grabbed it I'm crazy I know but I wanted it 
then I got this Wendy Becky Make Art Station. It's an all-in-one magnetic surface for stenciling, aligning, embossing, and creating. It's by Ranger. I'm going to take it out and show you what it does. I get tired of bringing out my mat and then I have to use washi tape on top of it. So I had seen other um, YouTubers use these and these you can get different sizes of this one. I got the seven by seven because I'm only gonna use it for stenciling. So I figured that would be the perfect size. So there's this metal plate and it's a seven by seven. It comes with four magnets and then a magnetic ruler. And so I have a stencil right here, which I didn't take out of the package, I'm sorry. I didn't think about it. So I can show you what this does, in case some of you don't know. Because before I saw it, I didn't, you know, I didn't know either. So the magnets hold it down and they are really good, it's a good grip. So now I can use this when I'm doing my stenciling. And I don't have to use any more washi and worrying about tearing my project. So that's what I got it for. And um, I like it a lot. And then it says you just wipe it clean with a damp cloth and you're done. So love that. And it wasn't too expensive. Next, I'm going to share what I got at Dollar Tree. So this was my first year. I made my very own wreath for Christmas, and I made it out of their candy cane wreath. And it came out so pretty, guys. And um, not to toot my own horn, but I toot it. And so I decided to do, they had a heart wreath. And I'm actually going to do two. I'm going to surprise my sister-in-law, and I'm going to send her one completed. So this is the wreath. It looks like this. I'm gonna do mine in red and hot pink. So I got the mesh. And I don't know if I'm gonna do hers in red and white, cause I have a red and a white that I got. Or if I'm just gonna do hers in red or red and pink also, I haven't decided yet. And then I bought this sprig and I haven't decided if I'm using the sprig yet or if I'm going back to get the rose with these on it. But I got this sprig to put in it to stick out. You know what guys, when I finish it, I didn't show y'all my candy cane one. If y'all wanna see it, I can show it to y'all next time. Um, oh, but I also got this ribbon to use in it also. So it's gonna be pieces of this showing through the wreath also. And it's red and hot pink and white. And it has the wire um, ribbon around it. It's wired. So I got that from the Dollar Tree. And then I got these pipe cleaners. That's how I tie my mesh off. I cut these in half. So pick that up. I also found, I forgot to bring it up here. I got my husband a little gnome. They had these plush ones and I surprised him with it. I said, here, baby, I love you. <laughs> and then I found these window clings. Aren't they adorable guys? <laughs> I think I'm going to stick them on my mirror in the bathroom. I just loved them. Okay. I also found socks because I think I've told y'all about my obsession. You know what? I forgot to grab one of them. Dang it. Wait, did I? No, I got it. I found another gnome, a new gnome pair for Valentine's Day. And then I found these soft, the soft ones that I really like. Um, so I got these ones. Cause I wear socks every day, guys. I always, I'm cold all the time. I got these 
And then these are probably my favorite besides the gnomes, but I got these ones. Then I found these little felt hearts. You get 12 pieces. And they had doilies there, guys, but the doilies are way too big for cards. And these are thin enough to put on your card. So I got them in the white. They had them in pink. And they had them in red. So I'm just going to use them as doilies. And the last thing that I got from Dollar Tree were these two ribbons. So this has a glitter um, trim right there on the edge. And these are sloths holding a heart. They are stinking adorable. I hope y'all can see them really good. So that's the only two ribbons I grabbed other than the one I'm using in my wreath. So that's everything I got from the Dollar Tree. They had really cute stuff. Um, next, I went to um, Target. And I was just browsing and I found there was no Valentine stuff other than I went over to buy the cards and they had this spritz area and they had this sticker bucket. And it has all these different glitter stickers and all different colors and then on the back they had these sticker gems in different colors and then it also had if you look close it has the conversation heart stickers and this was for five dollars and I thought that that was a really good deal for all of these you get 240 pieces for five dollars and different sizes. See how tiny they get? And they get big. Well, not really big, but a decent size. So yeah, I grabbed these. And the other thing I got from Target, I love this. So I have one of those caddies on my desk right now. One of those totes. And I don't really like it. It's gaudy and um, takes up too much room. So I found this really pretty white um, tin and it has this on it which you won't see it because it'll lay um, but on the inside it had dividers so I'm gonna put the things that I use the most in here on my desk and this is way smaller it is so cute it was only eight dollars I love it so this is going on my desk and that was everything I got from Target. I really didn't, I mean, find much. And I was happy with the, what I did find. Um, next, I'll show you what I picked up from eBay. I picked up this Quick Cut Sweet Box. Looks like this. You get three dies. So you get those labels at the bottom, and then this is what the die looks like. So I love that. And then I also picked up the Quick Cuts Berry Basket, and you also get um, three dies with this one. And I've always wanted a berry basket. So you get two dies also for the little tags and then you get the berry basket itself. I love it. So I grabbed that. Then I have something coming in and I'm not gonna talk about it yet because I want y'all to see it, but I have bought this to use with it. Um, this is a paper pad by Simple Stories called Kissing Booth. It's two, from 2018, it's discontinued, and this was so hard for me to find, but I did find it on eBay. And it is so cute, guys. So those are all the papers you get on there. And then you get a sticker sheet on the back with all those words on the bottom, which I'm gonna need. 
I love this hot air balloon up here where my thumb is. I think that is so stinking cute. Um, so yeah, I got that. On eBay, I was also able to find some things that went with it, but not very much. But I'm happy with what I did find. So from one seller, I found the 4x6 stickers. There's 210 stickers. There's eight sheets. And they look like this. And then here's what you get. And then from another seller, I found the Kissing Booth Puffy stickers and the washi tape. It came as a um, group. So I grabbed that. So I was happy to be able to get some of the things that went to it. Okay. Um, oh, and the lady that I bought it from, she sent me some die cuts thinking me for the purchase so that was really sweet next I placed an order with butterfly reflections Inc and the shop is owned by a lady named Vanessa and she is super sweet here is the website in case you're interested okay and this is what I got. I got the Lawn Fawn Clear Embossing. This is for um, embossing. <laughs> it's like a watermark ink pad. That's exactly what it is. Like your Versamark. And I own all of Lawn Fawn colors, but I didn't have the clear. So I went ahead and grabbed it because she was having a 25% off her shop. So I also picked up this um, 3D arch banner by Mama Elephant, and it looks like this. Then I picked up the sentiment strips by Mama Elephant, and there's three of those. And then by Mama Elephant, I also picked up the Happy Valentine's Day Scripty um, word die. It's really pretty. Then I picked up the Alt New Rounded Rectangle die set. And there's the size of it. There's one, two, three, four. And the last thing I picked up was from Pink Fresh Studio, and it's called the Essentials Stitch Scallop Rectangles. So the front looks like this, and these are what they look like, and I did cut them out so you could see them. So they're actually frames. And the biggest one cuts out two frames. And then the second one cuts out two frames. And if you wanted to, you can glue them together if you want to make like one big frame for, you know, the first one and the second one, or you can do use them all separate. So that, I don't know if y'all saw that. If y'all can see that. Really pretty dies. Okay, and then my last little bit to share is from Tuesday morning. I picked up the We Are Memory Caper, Keepers Crafters Essentials Small Precision Scissors, and I love these for um, fussy cutting. So they look like this, and they were $4.99. Then, I had um, told y'all about um, Stephanie Bernard from the Stamps of Life. She's supposed to be having something come out this month where you need acrylic paints. I had picked up that small kit for $6.99 while well, I returned it when I saw this kit. 
So they had a kit of acrylic paint set, 48 pieces by Studio 71 for $19.99. So I went and I grabbed this. And it has, oh my gosh, it's heavy, guys. 48 different colors in here. And it includes neons. Neons, is that what I said? Right? Yeah, it includes neons and metallics. I'm not gonna take them out because it's hard to get them back in. And there's so many in here, guys. And the size of them are one liter, oh, it's one liter total. They're 0.74 fluid ounces each, or 22 milliliters each. I mean, there's enough in each one. It's a good amount. I was happy to find this. Okay, the next thing I found were these Bow Bunny candy dots, and they were on clearance. So I got the additional 25% off on top of the 20%. Okay. The same goes with these. These were 20% off with an additional 25% off. Then I found this uh, Simple Stories, Simple Vintage My Valentine, which I pretty much have almost all of this except for the paper which I purchased. Um, it's coming. But I found the stamp set, so I grabbed it. I think it's so pretty. Um, and then I purchased some more paper. Let me get that for you guys, because I have that to share. And then I have some Crafter's Companion kits I purchased that I want to share with you guys. Depending on how much time I'm at, I might do that in a separate video. But I picked up some more solid color cardstock because I'm low on colors. I needed different colors. And you can't beat $3.99 for 25 sheets. So I got this one called Sparkle by Basil. I got one called Bark. I got one called Berrylicious. I got one called Guava Sensation. I got one called Daisy. Then I got one called Ocean Oasis. This one's a 12 by 12. And the last 12 by 12 of the basil that I got is called Boardwalk and it has the dots on it, the raised dots. It's like a chocolate. Then I had picked up the Practically Perfect in the 12 by 12 um, paper pack, I decided to also pick it up in the kit. So I've already went through and showed you what it looked like. Um, but I also wanted to get this set with the stickers. Because I really like this paper pad. So there you go. And then I found this Kaiser Craft called Everlasting. For $4.99. I thought that was a wonderful price and the papers are so pretty. So let me show you what they look like. I'll bring it in so you can see. And it also comes with a sticker sheet that looks like this. Isn't that pretty? And you get the words at the top. Very pretty paper. And the last paper pad I got was this crap, Crafter's Companion text, Textured Cardstock in Warm Tones. And it has um, reds, pinks, and kind of a purple. Perfect for Valentine's. 
I really like it. For $8.99, you get um, 36 sheets. And it's 230 GSMs. Okay, now, let me see where we're at. Sorry, guys. Okay, we're going to go ahead and stop. And I will come back and I'll do the kit shares. Okay, guys? I love you guys. Thanks for watching. Bye.